I installed my window AC inside my house, vented to the outside of my house. And the whole conversion cost me $5, actually less than $5 in material uh, and the bookcase that I use, I already had. But I went to Lowe's and was pricing up stuff to do it and it came to like $40. And uh, I decided to go shopping at Walmart to think about it. And uh, saw these hot and cold bags, insulated bags that hang in the grocery section for a dollar a piece. So that was two dollars. I bought two of them. And uh, they work really good. I mean, uh, they, they kept stuff really cool all day in the desert. And I bought a roll of duct tape for a dollar. So that's three dollars. Already had cardboard that I used. Uh, I'll probably have to replace that. Might get too wet. And inside I built a box frame about 5 by 13 out of cardboard just to hold the vent open. I taped that vent material all in a square after I cut it down to rectangles, 2 foot by 4 foot rectangles around the back square to the air conditioner, try not to block any vents and double it over where I needed to and then I cut it and taped it to a vent um, right there. And you can scrunch it up a little bit, it doesn't have to be exact. And of course you can see how the window just sits there perfect on top of it. And we all know air conditioners create condensate. I saw this video from a gentleman that showed how he used a paper towel to wick the back of his air conditioner and I tried it it worked great. I just had to cut a little slot in the bottom of the insulating vent material to run it through and it works fine. Uh, that's about six hours worth of condensate so I'm probably gonna get me a dish pan and just to uh, show you you can probably hear it running now and it hadn't been off very long Blown cold air, it's gonna get really cold. Oh, it feels so good because this room was getting room was getting warm. Uh, seems to work fine. Uh, I actually run it on low most of the time. And uh, here's a horrible diagram I did. I probably screenshot it. It might come in handy. It might not. And so there you go. Uh, excluding the bookcase and the cardboard that I already had, I really spent three dollars so far. And it works great. Probably better than the expensive material I would have got at Lowe's. Uh, if you can't figure out how to do it from what I've shown you here, it's really just a little kid's art project if you ask me. Um, you probably shouldn't be doing it. Enjoy.